We are learning new information now about the deadly crash that killed a Prince George's County police officer. Officer Brennan Rabane died Saturday morning when his officer, or when his cruiser rather, went off the road and crashed into a fence. Richard Reeve is following this story. He is live at police headquarters. Rich? Yes, Scott, the Prince George's County Police Department and indeed much of Prince George's County in mourning after the loss of that officer. Now, even as we speak, uh, police are holding a news conference. They're showing reporters uh, a red light camera video that shows the deceased officer's car going down Greenbelt Road and a van driving in the area. Police say they are very interested in that van. Uh, they think it is not a person of interest necessarily, but possibly a witness to what happened. Now, let's back up a little bit and explain what happened. This crash uh, happened just around 3 o'clock in the morning, uh, very early Saturday morning. We're told uh, that Officer Ruben was trying to make a traffic stop there along Greenbelt Road near Goodluck Road. Uh, he was not alone in that car, according to the police FOP. His girlfriend was inside the vehicle. Uh, that is permitted. Uh, it's to the discretion of police officers to have a civilian inside a car when it is off duty. Uh, apparently, during that time, while he was pursuing a car uh, that was speeding and driving erratically, according to a radio report, uh, he slid off the road, jumped on the curb, and then smashed his squad car into a fence. He was killed, but the girlfriend suffered only minor injuries. The police still looking for that other car, that speeding car. Uh, we have been told that detectives have interviewed the girlfriend, but that she has been heavily medicated, heavily sedated. Uh, they will likely have to talk to her again. We're also told police have interviewed at least three different witnesses to this. So uh, authorities still trying to put this together, obviously looking for more information since they now have that red light camera video, uh, hoping to get that out and hoping to reach that witness who may have seen something. Back to you, Scott. All right. Thank you for that update, Rich.